I mean, I can't even do anything. Like, what the hell? All right, I got a lot of money. So I guess I'm just gonna... That wasn't the right hero to get, but all right. Build a boat. Get on it. And... Where shall we have you go? Let's have you just come down this river here. Sure. Why not? Yeah. So, I mean, it's never a good idea in a video game to abandon your entire fan base that you've built over the decades. And the thing is, is that honestly, they're trying to change it so much, and the only reason that they're keeping the name is because, like, they, they keep Heroes of Might and Magic, and they're like, yeah, if we keep the name, we'll keep the fans, but we can change it all we want. It's like, no, that's how you lose those fans. Guys, get it through your heads. If you're gonna keep it Heroes of Might and Magic, guess what? Before Heroes of Might and Magic, there was a game called Might and Magic, and you know what Might and Magic was? It was a Dungeons and Dragons type game. You ran through dungeons, like a maze with a guy, and you had other people that you'd run into, like a cleric, and a wizard, and a priest, or whatever, right? I mean, I, I, I vaguely remember, I was like five when I either played or saw my family members playing Might and Magic, the original games of the Heroes of Might and Magic series and everything. And, you know, once somebody in either 3DO or New World Computing came up with the idea of heroes of my let, let's let's have them be heroes and they control armies of monsters like this you know what they did they changed the name to Heroes of Might and Magic. So if you want to change the core mechanics of the game, then you better change the title of the game. And no, I'm not referring to going to Might and Magic Heroes 7, because there's no Might and Magic Heroes 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, or 6. But that's because they apparently are working for Microsoft. They don't know how to number. They don't know how to math right. They don't know how to count right. <laughs> Honestly. Uh, so I don't know what the hell I'm doing. I'm terrified of going on any mainland at all. Like, let me let me see here what, what we got here. Are there any heroes in this area? No. Any heroes in this area? No. Any heroes in this area? No. Any at all here? There's nothing un un there's unknown there. Ah, here we go. Yeah, some uh, halflings and some black dragons. That's fucking great. Oh, and um, uh, here we've got uh, uh, some halflings, some skeletons, some goblins, and some black dragons. So uh, that's fucking great. And uh, anybody else? Any anywhere? Anywhere else? Got some? Uh, no. Okay. Well, uh, I don't fucking like my chances going on any island at all. I don't like my chances. So, just gonna not. Okay. Just gonna let this bitch sail around. And meanwhile, my other guy's just gonna sit here. Because that's how I scout. And I know that they're gaining in all their crazy ass troops by them, me doing, letting them do that and everything. But I got no resources anywhere to draw from because Oi this game right now Did I just miss the concept of what I was supposed to do this scenario because that's what it seems like It seems like I missed the memo of what I should be doing Should be taking the castle. Well, I'm trying to find the castle and then there's the fact that they already have black dragons. And I don't even have a fucking wizard. So, that's lovely. Do we even know where this ultimate wizardry tower town is? It'd be lovely if somebody could show me the Show me the way to go to the wizard castle. Is it 
down river? Is it up river? Oh, this might be it. This might be it. It's a wizard cat. Oh, there's there. That is there is the four doors. There are the four doors. Um, let's just uh, Ross, come on. I'm gonna go ahead and assume that uh, no. So okay, let's. Nope, nope. That, that river just dead ends there. So let's go over here. Dra grasping at straws. Here, just grasping at straws. Oh, great. Pop populations are halved. Hope that I didn't have anything. Did I remember to get my troops? I believe I did. So that's good, at least. Can I get my ivory tower? Oh my god. I can't get anything. I have a gem mine, and that's it. That's all I've got. Oh, yellow paper has been vanquished. I'm so glad that I'm making such a big contribution to this level right now, guys. This is fan fucking tastic you know they could have started me with a little bit of a bigger army and a little bit of a bigger island with some resources around me anything oh fuck that asshole just opened up all three four four three of three of the four doors right let me guess did he just win no good uh, this way. I don't know. Sailing around in circles. What even is going on here? Oh boy. Like, even if I actually find the castle, what am I gonna do? Cause, cause I don't have a goddamn army amongst anything that can take up take on even one black dragon you know if they have one black dragon that they probably have a castle that has more black dragons and so it's just gonna be a big fuck you where I have this army of shit and they've got an army of a million black dragons because that makes sense when I haven't seen a single dragon castle in this place is this Sherman. Who names a castle Sherman? And I mean a sorceress castle too. That's just dumb. That's my castle Sherman. Okay. I don't like how the, all the music's gone. It makes it too quiet. So the sailing and that's all of the sound we get. Oh my god, there's a mine! I know there were two mines over there off to the southeast corner that were unguarded. But right now this mine looks like it's unguarded and that's important. Because if it it's guarded. God damn it. Well, the least I can do is Grab that flotsam and have some money and wood. Yep. This is such an interesting level. So interesting. I landed on this little island. Is there anybody here? Please tell me there isn't. That would be f fucking terrible if there were. <laughs> don't like the person there to scare me hey lady you could just you know go to that windmill every day for the rest of your life or every week for the rest of your life that'd be great you know just live on that island and go to the, go to the windmill every week and go hi how you doing I'm gonna take your resources and ship them off to my weird homeless friend who's trying to build an army out of scraps to fight an army of black dragons. Cause that's the great. That's what we need. Ah, uh, sulfur. Cool. And that was this island, okay. Good to know. It's got an interesting shape to it, you know? 
the landmass of this map. It's cool. Wish there were some resources that I could gather on it. But apparently I had to be super fast to go gather all the resources. And because they've got dragons and they'll just fucking kill me in an instant. Have I mentioned they have dragons yet? And I think that's fucking bullshit. Makes me think that I should just fucking cheat. Give myself dragons. Fuck them. They clearly cheated to get dragons. Because they don't have any dragon castles, that's for damn sure. I'd have to look up the cheat to find to give me dragons though. Okay. So the swirling aisles of whatever the fuck. I like how they just teleport around randomly. Like that does something for them. Oh my gosh, there's a crystal mine there, but I'm psh see that it's guarded by Elves of some sort, some variety. So they can only teleport through line of sight, I believe. They're like, uh. I can't think of a character that can only do that. Oh my god, I'm drawing a blank on characters. Nightcrawler doesn't have to do that, he can teleport through walls. But I think he has to visualize the location. Oh, uh, duh, but, nope, I don't remember her name. It's a character from the Flash TV series, and she's not even that big of a character. She was just in, like, one episode, but she had line of sight teleportation and everything. So, I mean, as long as they can't see my island from their islands, they're fine. Or from any island that they can get to. I think I'm fine, and they can... Oh, shit, they're... That was... Oh, yeah, no, that was right there. Wasn't it? There was like a swordsman paladin person like right somewhere around here and they took them out. Oh my god, they're on the island. They could probably see this island and therefore come take me out. Or maybe not. Maybe I'm wrong. I'm gonna try and get up to here at some point somehow. I probably went the wrong way for that, huh? Yeah, that's gonna be a problem. Where? Where's my island? There I am. Okay. God, if only sailing didn't take a fucking year and a half. That would be lovely. I mean, I honestly don't know what I'm supposed to do in this fucking scenario. I mean, I know what I'm supposed to do, guys. I've kind of been over this. But I don't have a big enough... Well, now I might have a big enough army to... Now there are a horde of dwarves, you see? These, these, these problems just come up where I I go, yeah, I might be able to do that thing. And then I go to try and it's like, all right, they grew in size too. So now I grew a horde of these guys in order to take out some of them. And now I have a horde and now they have a horde. And so now I'm still going to lose a shit ton, if not all of my guys for doing such things as the, these. So I think stationary army should just never gain in troops. That was the whole bullshit of the last scenario where it was like, hey, look, we're going to have all these fucking dragons. Oh, great. Game, game, yeah, game crashed. Love that. All right. Hey, look, sound's back. I love it when sound returns like that. Makes me feel a little bit more comfortable about things, at least. I... Sure. Why not? Just landed on your island and you immediately come to kill me. It's very rude, you know that? You're very unhospitable. How dare you? You killed one of my rocks. I don't appreciate that. Don't. Why do you get good morale? Why are you a fucking prick? You don't deserve good morale. You're garbage. Die. Like the trash that you are. Thank you. Okay. Hey, look, a message in a bottle. Island of the Meek. A swarm of peasants. I can't even land on it. I want to. 
I really want to. I want to land on it and either attack them or, you know, recruit them. But they won't let me. So are they really just cheating and using dragons in their armies? That's what it seems like, honestly. I guess my main army is now a little bit stronger. I can maybe take some of these guys out and get some resources from around the island and maybe amass something, but <laughs> they've already got dragons. Kind of hard to face off against that. I hate these cheating bastards. Hi, buddy. Oh, you want to run away? I'll, I will gladly allow that. You know, they already opened the gate for me. All I gotta do is walk on in and take the castle. It's easier said than done. I'm sure it's guarded by fucking dragons. Alright. Or at least something. Alright. Get this guy. He gives me the rabbit's foot. Great. Lovely. Can I do something with that? I mean, I know what I can do with it, but, you know, is there some actual purpose for it right now? Yep, okay. Send help. I'm poor. <coughs> and suck. Flotsam. I search the flotsam and find nothing. A mermaid? He's a mermaid. Oh, I can't get through that part? Why, why can't I get on that river? Why not? Why is that river special? Oh, the archers want to fight. Great. Just great. I mean, honestly, like, they act almost like the Orb of Negation is actually supposed to, like, even out the battle or something. Like, having the Orb of Negation will make it so that I can take on armies of massive por proportions without, or with, without having an army of massive proportions myself. But, no, I can't. They still have creatures to fight. Their main power is not just the spells that they cast. It's also the troops that they wield. The strong creatures. Hey, I have completely forgot about you, Marco. You will garden this gem mine pretty good? Yeah, you do that, boy. I don't want to send Marco to his death by having him, you know, go take on the... Necromancer town here. I'm sure this is swarming with enemies. It's terrible. Go away. No. So there. I won't. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. Okay. Damn right you stay that far away, wolves. I have a restraining order. Oh my god. Kill him. Kill him dead. Oh, so sorry. You're not one wide. You can't fit through that, can you? You killed three iron golems? Keep going. Keep trying. Keep trying, boy. Keep trying. Come on, keep, come fight me. Get smashed. Iron golems, attack back. Damn it. Do damage. Stupid iron golems. I mean, at least they make a really good wall. Lovely. Expert ballistics. And we'll get that. We'll get that. And we'll, oh my god, there's a throng of orc chiefs. Because that's so fucking useful. Like, it's like right there. I can feel it if I just go up that path. That's why there were the four doors there, but... 
alas, they won't let me through. Huh. 